Hello everybody, Azumi here, and let's do a Plotting Princess 8 star. This is just going to be solo, I'm not bothering to multi-solo it, it's a ranked one so I don't really see the point in it except for to get extra drops, it makes it a little bit more stamina efficient. But my first up is going to be Camille. Second is Port. Got all my rings done finally. Took me a while. Lumiere. And Squirrel Girl. I am not attempting to pronounce that. Because I know I'm not going to get it right. And let's go. And as you can see, I'm not doing any editing. It's going to be a busy day for me today. So. Alright, so this this battle is pretty straightforward as far as I'm concerned. Um, you just need to use a lot of earth attack. And if you're doing like probably 7 and 8 star, then you need to use elves, dwarves, starian, and beast. And you need to defeat the crew crystals rather quickly because they're going to block a lot of damage from Rovaria. Sorry if you heard that sound. I dropped my phone on the floor. But that's the reason I'm using Lumiere is for sure shot to get around that a little bit. Because sometimes I can do this really fast and sometimes it takes a couple of minutes. It, it really just depends on how things proc really. But I'm doing it way faster with Lumiere than I was without her. Because I tried it with Senia at first. But, I mean, she works really good. But I'm getting a lot faster times with Lumiere. So, we'll, we'll just stick with her. I'm going to probably do some pulls for the two new Apocalypse characters tonight. And we'll see. Of course, I want, you know, the green haired girl. I'm, I'm kind of collecting those now. I got Tatsumaki. I got most of them, I think. And see, that time those crystals just melted. And I kind of like Camille because she has Soul Spring, and then Squirrel Girl has Soul Spring to, to three. So that technically means I can get four of the people in my party with Soul Spring. And I could probably remove the healing gear off of them completely. But I'm just lazy and build everybody pretty much the same. I'm not really going for speed here. Is what I'm saying. I'm going for, I want to win, 100% win rate. And that's about it. I don't I don't really care how long it takes because I'll just sit here and grind longer. It don't matter to me. I don't have much else to do. Alright, come on, come on, come on. Now I kind of missed the connect battles during the One Punch Man collab where you could just throw Saitama in there and literally just as soon as his skill procs, that's it for that health bar. It was kind of funny as a, as, a, as a joke type thing. I know it's realistically not going to work in most other fights, but it's funny. If it wasn't for Squirrel Girl being boosted, I would probably use somebody else. But she also gives, I think, bonus elemental damage, so that's pretty nice. No, I'm just basically stalling for time here. I don't want it to be silence for the rest of the video. You know what I'm saying? So I got like another 40 odd seconds to, to kill. Let me tell you, I walked to the store today just for fun. I don't know why. It's hot. It's 90 something degrees. It's the summertime. I live in the south. Um, 
I mean, it was a good walk. My neighborhood is pretty nice, but... Uh, I was soaking wet by the time I got back. That's how hot it is. Alright, come on, Rovario. About done here. Now, see, sometimes I'll clear it with two minutes plus left. It just really depends on how things proc. Alright, let's check out who did the most here. And port by a long shot. So, there you go. And this was Azumi. Thank you for watching and have a good day.